Welcome to the XTS Touchscreen Basic Programming and Operation Overview, brought to you by FETCO. The models we are covering today are the CBS 2130 XTS series for 3 liter and 1 gallon AirPods, CBS 2140 XTS series for 1 gallon thermal dispensers, and the CBS 2150 XTS series for 1.5 gallon thermal dispensers. The new XTS touchscreen coffee brewing system software is designed to streamline the setup, programming, and processes and bring out the best that extractor branded products have to offer. With the XTS coffee brewing system, it is now easier than ever to set up and program, control the brew cycle, understand the brew status, access brew metrics as well as the ability to customize the XTS display screen to tie in your branded products and brand messaging. Before we begin, let's review two important points. Although there are many features and functions built into the XTS system software, this video is intended only to cover some of the basic operator steps used on a daily basis. All of the information in this video is subject to change. Please refer to the latest user guide for detailed information on the full functionality of the XTS brewing system. Now, let's get started. In this video, you will learn how to access all of the legendary extractor brew controls, program a recipe, walk through the entire brew cycle, review screen layouts, and learn visual cues, access demo mode for training and customer demos, Customize your XTS touchscreen display using an SD card slot. Update your brewer software with an SD card. Access the diagnostic and brewing metric tools. Accessing the extractor brew controls. Take your coffee to its peak level by unlocking the full freshness, aroma, and flavor of your taste profile with the legendary extractor brewing technology by setting individual parameters such as brew volume, brew time, number of pulses, pre-wet percentage, pre-wet delay, bypass percentage, and drip delay. How to access the legendary extractor brew controls. Cycle the power off, wait about five seconds, and then turn it back on. Within five seconds, press and hold the screen until you enter the programming mode. Let's walk through programming a recipe. Make sure that you are in the programming mode. Scroll down and select the specific batch you want to program. You can scroll right or left to change the batch. Once you've selected the batch, scroll down until you see batch summary. If you scroll down again, this will give you the current batch summary for batch one regular. Press the screen again to return. Scroll over until you see batch volume. At this point, let's reset the batch volume to 1.55 gallons. Scroll up to return to the menu and over to program the brew time. Let's change the brew time to 5 minutes. Again, returning to the main menu, we're going to scroll over and change the number of pulses to six. The next parameter is the pre-wet percentage. Again, we're going to set this to 10 percent. Scroll up to return to the previous menu and over to the next parameter. Pre-wet delay we're going to set to 30 seconds. Next parameter is the bypass percentage. 
and we're going to set this to 10%. And finally, the drip delay, we're going to set to two minutes. You have just programmed a batch. Let's walk through an entire brew cycle, review screen layouts, and learn visual cues. To initiate a brew cycle, touch the screen to unlock. Once the screen is unlocked, Select the side on which you want the brew to occur. Right now we are biased for a left side brew. To select the right, touch anywhere on the right side of the screen. To select left, touch anywhere on the left side of the screen. To initiate a brew cycle, select the recipe, press and hold for one second. Once the brew has started, you will receive visual indication via an icon and a countdown timer. You will also have the ability to receive further information about your brew, as well as stop a brew currently in process. On twin machines, you are also able to start a brew on the opposite side. The current icon depicts that a brew is in process. Once the brew has finished, you will see the drip icon, the remaining time for the drip cycle, and you will also notice that the stop button has disappeared. To access demo mode for training and customer demos, scroll until the main menu reads Other. At that point, scroll down and then once again scroll over until you see the demo mode. Once again, scroll down, turn demo mode on, and move the cursor up. You have now entered the demo mode. Please note that a custom graphic design and file saving on the SD card has very specific guidelines as to how it needs to be formatted to appear properly on the XTS screen. See the custom file instruction slide at the end of this segment for details on how to prepare the file for displaying a custom graphic on the XTS touchscreen. To insert a custom logo into your extractor XTS touchscreen, it is necessary to insert the SD card into the slot. Once that is done, cycle brewer power off and on again. You will see a screen indicating that the logo is uploading and has finished its upload process. At this point, turn the brewer off, remove the SD card from the slot, and turn the brewer on your new logo is now displayed. In order to update the firmware on this brewer, it is necessary to peel back the rubber cover located on the right side. After the program has been put on an SD card slot, insert the SD card slot in this fashion. It is then necessary to cycle the machine power off, wait a few seconds, and cycle on. The firmware update will happen automatically. Once the firmware has been uploaded, 
cycle machine power off. Remove the SD card from the slot and replace the cover. And turn the unit on. You have just upgraded the firmware. To access the diagnostic and brewing metric tools, scroll through the main menu until you see other. At this point, scroll down to the secondary menu and once again scroll through until you see counters. Scroll down to activate the function and there are your total counters. This concludes our brief instructional video on basic programming and operation of the XTS Touchscreen Brewer Series by FETCO. If you have any questions on the information you saw today, please contact your FETCO sales representative or visit FETCO.com to download the latest available information on products and services offered by FETCO. Thanks for watching.